I'm really close to you. Hello, Stu. <laughs> Why do birds suddenly appear? I feel like if you start and singing, we're never going to get to the You are near. <laughs> hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> Uh, it's my show. That's why I turned that way. Ah. Uh, we're if you see this background. It's because we're actually in a timeshare right now in Anaheim, California. We went to IMAS this weekend. Woo! We spent a lot of money. Uh, if you would like to see what we got, Sarah will put the haul over on her channel. If it's live, I'll link it below. If not, it'll show up sometime soon. But you should subscribe to her. She is not your typical doll face here on YouTube. Uh, we are going to do a what we brought in our makeup bags, and I was not expecting to do this video. She brought it up in the car, and I was like, oh, probably would have figured out my, like, what I wanted to bring thing a little bit more. But this is the real life, guys, so you're going to see what we brought. Okay. Do we have, like, a rhyme or reason? Do you want to do, like, bass first? Sure. It's all about that bass. About that bass. So I brought this one, which Noel got me. And it's awesome. I brought this one. I actually have two. I no, this one. also got her stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and I also have this Charlotte Tilbury one. That's the holiday one. And it I says... I can see the little... Give the woman... Yeah. Give the woman the right makeup and she can conquer the world. And it has a little lipstick pull. Oh my gosh, so cute. Okay. So... I have a lot of base products here. I went to working too. I brought Nirvana Black. Uh, Nirvana... What is it? This is Nirvana? Yeah. Elizabeth and James. James. Never the black. Ooh. How was that? I brought no perfume. No perfume. I also brought Joey, a tiny black opium. No way. Are you coming? Are you gonna do your thing? You gonna... yeah, but I don't have any perfume. No, I, well, I'm just talking. Oh, okay. While we dig. Something to talk about so they don't have to watch us. I also brought a little tiny black opium from YSL. The shiz is bomb. Although, I'm kind of concerned now after our dinner discussion. Should we tell them? What? About the beavers? It's not in there. Okay. We get told that raspberry flavoring and vanilla flavoring, when they say natural flavors, is like that is beaver secretion from their butts. It up. From their butts. <laughs> but I don't think it's in that one. Okay, that's a mask. Also, I don't want to know because I like that perfume <clears throat> too much. Okay, I brought this Illa Masca Hydra Veil that Sarah gifted me a while ago. For a little bit of base. Okay, um, so it's lovely. It is the skin equalizer. I bought it full size this time, I was hoping I got the right one. So I got a sample from my other friend Noel of this Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer Base Illuminator and I ended up buying the full size today after I wore this because it's like, it's really beautiful. And I have the redness corrector, like so I beautiful. swear by this stuff to make me less red. I'm not wearing it now, I'm not wearing any makeup except lipstick right now because we match. We're also wearing matching t-shirts which you, you can't, can't really see. see them, so. We should post a picture. Oh, we'll post a picture, yeah. And then we'll show it. They're cute. Okay, I also, in, in the base realm, oh, yeah, oh, do you have one more? Base. No, I only have one. Okay. Primer. I brought, yeah, I brought a lot of base, because it's all about that base. Um, here's the Angel Veil and the NYX Pore Filler, and I mix these two together and use them to, like, spackle and prime my face, and it works out really well. My makeup lasted pretty good. Today. Yeah, no, it did a really yeah. good job. So, I have um, videos on these. I'll show them. I think I probably have this redness one also. So, if I do have videos on anything that I brought, I will link them down below for you so that you can... Enjoy those as well. <clears throat> foundation. Uh, foundation. Okay. So I depotted some of my Becca cream uh, foundation. I've had this on for like 14, 13 hours at this point. I'm I'm itching my nostril. Not picking That's not my ass. video. <laughs> In her video, she's <laughs> doing that too, and I'm like. Anyway. <laughs> I itch my nostrils in like three quarters of my videos. Um, I've been wearing this for like 14 hours in the sun or whatever, and it's still holding up really great. Mm -hmm. So I brought some of this with me. I brought um, two foundations. I brought the Too Faced Born This Way, which is what I wore today. Um, I'll cool. insert a picture of us if you want to see our oh, makeup yeah. today. Yeah, so you can they can see your baller lipstick because that was pretty awesome. Oh, it was cool. Yeah. <clears throat> Born This Way. And I also brought the By Terry um, Terribly... Well, how do you say that word? Denseless? Denseless? Yeah. Denseless. Tint Serum Focus. That's not a real word. I can't say these words. Anyway. It is the Wrinkle Control Serum Foundation, which is hella expensive, but totally awesome. Like, this is a $100 foundation. It looks like skin. If you want to look natural, these two and naked skin are the but way to go. Can someone explain to me what is the point of putting foundation on if it's just going to look like skin? Because it evens your skin tone out so that you look naturally beauty, beautiful. 
be beautiful. I be, used to be trust beautiful. That. That's what you're telling me. Naturally beautiful. Can I put that on my face? Like, yeah. Not right now. No, totally. Yeah, okay. You absolutely can. Okay, and then did you bring concealer? No. Oh, yeah. that's a lie. I brought under eye concealer. I brought my collections, which I've rubbed off all the writing. It's the collections concealer number one fair, but I use it underneath my eye. That stuff is no joke. Like, I have like two layers of we it. We don't have that, that brand in the United States. No, I got this in the UK. And it's probably Canada too, yeah? No, we don't have collections in Canada. Oh, okay. It's a UK, it's a UK thing. thing? Yeah. So we can't get that either. Um, I brought the Naked Skin Under Eye Concealer. All of these things were in my yearly favorites, so in case you're seeing you a favorite. Yeah, did, did you watch it? it? Now I feel like you're a bad friend. <laughs> if it posted before I left to come see you, then I watched no, it. No, I'm totally kidding. I was, yeah, you don't, I'm sure you totally did. Okay. I think you did, because I, I remember a comment. Because you're really, you're actually a better friend, because you comment on all my videos. I don't comment on all your videos. Can't really but you post a lot more than me. That's true. Okay. Um, friendship does not matter in YouTube views. No, I agree. It's an important thing. <laughs> oh, I also brought this um, e.l.f. High definition under eye setting powder because I friggin love it. I don't know if I've done a video on this, but if I have, I'll, I'll link a video. Um, I use this to uh, set, uh, set my under eyes high. Did you use it's it today? Yeah, I did. Okay. It's kind of sparkly, um, and it's beautiful. And Tara Baby feels good. Yeah, she Tara does. from Tara Baby. See, yes. Um, I don't know where we're at at this point. Are um, we talking about powder? Should I bring out my powder? So well, I no. I mean, that's just for under eye setting. So if you want to talk about powder, you can. I also brought um, what is this? Rub de Miel. Lip balm. I totally have a video on this. This is awesome. Sorry. These are nice Well, so for setting underneath my eyes, I brought my duo in, from Mac in mm -hmm. uh, Emphasize, Bone Beige and Emphasize. But I used the color Emphasize, which is what's this one. Jaclyn Hill uses it. Oh yeah. We met Jaclyn Hill. I will never get tired of saying that. We met Jaclyn Hill. All in sort of picture. Hill. It's a very fuzzy picture. I was just, like shaking. I'm. I, it was I lost my words. I couldn't string a sentence together. My heart was beating out of my chest. I managed to actually talk to her, and she then just, put like, full sentences. Basically, together. Basically, forced a hug on her, and she yeah. was lovely. And we met her mom too, and that was really awesome. Mm -hmm. um, if we're gonna talk about, like, are you talking about powder? We're gonna do eyes. Eyes. Okay, let's do eyes. Um, so. Because I have a bunch of crap. Yeah, you go. So I brought this Taylor Grey paint pot from MAC, which I think you guys know what it looks like. Um, so that's what it's on my eyes right now. Well, let me see that. Oh, that's beautiful. You don't have it? No. You I, don't, have I it. don't have a lot of paint box. It's on my job. I, have, what do you I just use? haven't gotten. Eyeliners? For what? Bases? Oh, I just, sometimes I prime, but I didn't even do that today. Oh, okay. I, I was, I told you I would have thought about this a lot more. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> Um, I only brought one eye palette um, because I messed up. I was going to bring the Jaclyn Hill palette and then I just didn't grab it um, from Morphe, but because um, obviously everybody knows I love that. Um, but I brought the Tartlet original palette. I hope this doesn't blind you guys. Um, I brought the original Tartlet palette um, because it is not and beautiful. And then she loaned I me I brought the Lorac this palette, guy, which is the only one I brought. And then for mascara, I brought. Um, to try this new Fairy Drops mascara. Um, it's not actually new, I just, it's just new to me. I got this on Cult Beauty. Beauty. Cult Beauty. Cult Beauty sells it. I think it's like 18 bucks. Um, but you got that back, so it ends up being like 16 bucks. Um, which is kind of expensive for a mascara, but it is actually really nice. Like, I thought it was, it was okay. It held up very well. It didn't flake too much, although I got a little bit at the end of the day. But yeah, the waterproof one is better. It's better. Yeah. I think so too, but I don't like waterproof. I don't usually like waterproof, but out. that one. Dude, your mascara is freaking bomb. Like, I take told your glasses you this. Off, show them your her lashes. This is no no lashes. No lashes. Look at this. Like, can you see? Can you see? That's really good. You guys. It's this stuff. It's it's amazing. I have a video on it. I you can send you. You can probably find the link. Mm -hmm. We'll put a link down below. Mm -hmm. uh, it's the Maybelline Last Sensational Luscious. It's three coats of this stuff. Three. Huh? Amazing. Well, yeah, but you you probably don't need three. Okay. But it looks like false lashes. And did you curl? Nope. You're naturally curl. curl that way? Yeah. Well, and this stuff is really good, and, and it's it the curls. drugstore. Okay. So you should get some of this. I will, I will get some of that. I'm, I'm on board with this whole thing. You should get some of this. You all should get some of this. <clears throat> yeah. Um, I think what I have powder. is powders and lipsticks and then brushes. Can inside. I do eye stuff though? Yeah. Oh, you have okay, more. Okay, so yeah, I brought my... Oh. Anastasia uh, Dip Brow Pomade in Ebony. Oh. Because I got them done by the person that I trust, the, the only person I trust to do them. And they're they're pretty, they're just thin, so I like filling them in a little bit. And then she thinks I'm crazy, but it drove me insane. She calls me crying. I know, I'm not going to leave the smoke because then I'll start crying. And she's like super upset and I like, don't know what to do with myself. 
And she's like, you need to tell me something to distract me. So I go on like a 15 minute rant about how much I hate my brows and how it's the end of the world. And I'm like, I think I'm supposed to cheer you up, but I don't think this helped. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm and then she sends this. me a picture and I'm like, dude, your brows are like totally awesome. What are you talking about? Like, I, I stopped crying though. It works. Okay. I was like, shut up. Those are beautiful. <laughs> like I broke the credit. This, this was all part of my plan. It was totally part of the plan. Except I still think they're too fine. Anyways. Um, and then I bought these two Stila uh, oh, liners. Yeah. So this one is in Stingray, the black one, and Linefish. I think this one, though, is doing some weird business, because I keep wiping underneath my eyes. Uh -huh. um, and I think this one might be... There's I like the one of those that's kind of red. Yeah, there's a burgundy one that's really I pretty. love that one, because I like that burgundy eye color, generally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, no, it's, it's pretty. And it brings up the green. Yeah. Um, and then I bought my Kat Von D tattoo liner, which I put mascara on, then I forgot they didn't have liner on, so I just didn't put any liner on today. And then my clear brow gel from Honest Oh, that's a lot of eye products. Yeah. Yeah, but that is that. Cool. Cool. Um, so I have a few powder products, so do you have, like, I have some powder cheeks and stuff? Yeah. Um, so to, like, set the world, I brought my, um, Anas or Anastasia, my Hourglass, um, ambient lighting powder which contains dim light, incandescent light, and radiant light. Um, I love these things and today I just swirled through oh. all of them and just went all over my face to set. I don't normally set too hard because that's not, I don't, I don't know why, I'm just not a setter. Oh, um, I double set. I know. I, we have different makeup laws. Anyway, I set today oh my, I'm for, gonna be a drag queen. for various I'm reasons gonna and, <laughs> and um, I really liked this as a setting, like just all over setting, it was cool. Um, yeah. And take some sugar. I feel you like. Right now? Oh, no. Okay. No, yeah, just. Yeah. I, we're not doing the haul anymore. That's oh, really fair. Sad. I want to go play with my. Uh -huh. my this is haul. like This is stuff I already own. I want to go play with the new stuff. <laughs> fair enough. Oh, wait, I already own that too. Never mind. We're good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're wrong. Awesome. It's always that the haul is the one that we're like cracking up in. True. Because we're like super we also for this. It's also like the first one. So it's like. We just, everything is hilarious, and then we're like, okay, I mellowed out. Like, I'm good. Yeah, we're good. I've, I've we also don't have an audience this. anymore. True, that was We had an audience, audience for the last oh. one, and they were really good about keeping their shit together. But you could look over, and they'd be cracking up, and yeah. that would not help. Yeah, I know. Anyway, so... And we had, like, a five-minute laugh session in the middle of it, where I was like, I'm oh, keeping you should it all go in. to her channel and watch it. Just keep the whole thing. I'm keeping the like, whole thing. Yeah. I'll, like, trim the beginning and the end. Yeah. But I, I was so that. good. I didn't swear once. It was awesome. I was very proud of her. I even just described, um acts that men and women do together. You should go watch the video. It's yeah, it's great. Really telling you. It's <laughs> perfect. Um, so I brought two powders to set. I brought the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation to set my base after I put it on. And then I brought my Guerlain... Can you check that out later? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, my Guerlain Meteorite Perle, so the this one, which I've hit serious pen on. Can you just speak French to us for a little while? What do you always say? It's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Whoa, that really chunks out weird. Look at that. Look no, because it... Cause it some powders go more than others. Yeah. Like, yeah, because one's softer than another. I see. I don't know if you guys can um, see this, but it's pretty crazy. But I've hit major pen on it, but I love the look. You can technically buy a refill instead of buying the whole compact again. Yeah. I've got to figure out how to do that business. Oh, it's pretty easy. Nordstrom.com. That's okay. all you want. Yeah. No, no, no. How to depot and put the new pen in. Oh, I think it's really easy. I think it just works okay. out. Cool. But, yeah, so those are the two powders that I brought. And, like I said, this lasted all day long. So I mean, you've had your makeup on for, like... Like 14 hours now. Yeah. 14 hours. It's, yeah, and it's all. And like my eye makeup is the only thing that's And look at this of, highlight. But the highlight is still there. Yeah. Do you want me to tell it? Yeah, can we talk about this highlight? highlight? Let's just talk about the highlight. So this is the highlight palette. If you take nothing away from any of the like 600 videos I filmed, or the how many that you filmed. I don't know, but. Yeah. The one thing you should take away is that you need this highlighter palette yeah. in your life. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying. Uh, this is a sleek uh, highlighting palette in Midas Touch. And there goes the brush. That's what happened when you I filmed my video, too. Okay. It's, it's actually not bad. Oh, really? I'll show you. Yeah, okay. yeah. So I have the blue highlighter on today, but these are really pretty. Can I get it? Get it? Where is it? Don't stop. Get it. Get it. Just get it later. Okay, I'll get it later. Cool. Um, but, yeah, we had a girl stop us in line. Give him some cheek. Like, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Um, Do it. <laughs> I would like to surprise you all. Please contain yourselves with your shock to realize that I was wearing today what? some 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 Becca in champagne pop. 
Really? That is the highlighter you chose? Isn't it amazing? Amazing. I never would have You would have never guessed, right? Never. Right. In a million years. Um, I also had a, a bronzer on. That was the Body Shop Honey Bronzer. Oh, is that the bronzer you I love this bronzer. Yeah, if you're yeah. pale as F, this is the bronzer for you. Um, it is. It just warms your face up very gently. You can't mess it up. It's not too much. You can layer the heck out of it and you're still, you're just going to get a little bit warmer and look a little bit 3D again without looking bronze. Because you probably couldn't tell, like, it was a little, it was a dark gray. No, 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 but it was good. I, yeah. just, I didn't realize that it was that. Yeah. What did, did you have cheek products cheeks, on? Yeah, I, yeah. Cheek I bought a, she's like, I put on cheeks at the beginning being like, I'm going to, I'm going to try to get, She was t- so restrained. And she's like, this it is not going It was demure, work. people. And then I was like, no. So I put on, like, my my blue and gray lipstick. And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, and she's like, do you think I need more? And I'm like, yes. Yes, you do. And I'm not the one to ever tell you that. So I brought my Tarte uh, holiday palette from two years ago. Oh, that's uh, a good one. The cuff. So I used the bronzer and... I'm so these two angry I missed that. I bought this off eBay. I didn't oh, buy it okay. first hand. Because yeah. I was sad I missed it. And mm-hmm. then I waited a whole year and I still wanted it. Mm-hmm. So I just I'm ordered still it. Sad. So if you, the lessons learned, if you want your makeup and you think it's limited edition, it's never gone. Go to eBay and also go to Instagram. You can hashtag trend moon selling, trend moon mood buying and selling and the hashtag the makeup exchange. So it wasn't great. Uh-huh. I think originally it's like $45. Mm-hmm. I got it for 90 Yeah. Which is twice. And sometimes you pay the up price, but okay. if you really want something. So on my cheeks today was surprise, surprise, MAC Mineralized Blush and Warm Soul. Um, that's with, that's how I warm up the cheek. And then I threw on some ambient lighting blush because I just went all ambient. When I have to travel and I have to pack my bag quick, which is what I did, I just grabbed these two things because it's like, I'm guaranteed to like these. Um, and I think I went, I think I just swirled these together too. Like, I was um, not in the mood this morning. I was actually like not going to wear a face today and then... And then slowly... And then I slowly just like, put I, more on. I was taking so long, so she's like, I'm going to just put some I'm going to put on. a base on. I'm gonna put another base. Well, so if I put this base on, I might as well put on the foundation, foundation right? She's like, if I put on foundation, then I, I just wear like I have to bronze it this, because yeah. then I was like dead looking. And I just kept working and kept nodding, <laughs> and I had a full face on by then. Yeah, but my good. full face looks different than her full face. Like her full face looks really full. My full face looks like I put a it little makeup like, on. Yeah, well, exactly. A little bit. Mine is all this business. Yeah, but that's great. Although I was told at the body shop by this like Kuwaiti girl that was there, it was mm-hmm. actually super sweet. She's like. We're Middle Eastern. We go all out with our makeup. Mm-hmm. I'm like, that is very true. Yeah. I'm also, I think, secretly a drag queen. Yeah, I think you're secret. I don't think it's a secret. Queen. I think that's the case. Okay. I'm missing... Oh, so I had MAC Rebel in my pocket, and I don't know where that is now, but hopefully it's in my pocket. It'll be in there somewhere. I also brought with me Heavenly Hybrid, because this is a beautiful what? shade. Is that um, which is... Mm, I don't think so. I think... Well, maybe, but I think it comes out a lot. Like, it's popular. Okay. Um, it's just a little bit more, like, toned down. You want to swatch it? it? Yeah. And then I also brought the yield standard syrup um, because if when in doubt, you can wear syrup to visit your grandma, so whatever. Um, and then lastly, um, I brought setting sprays Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray, which I actually didn't wear, and um, Fix Plus, which I wore a lot of. And you have lips? I have lips. I don't have lipstick that I was wearing today, which is Dust by, by Makeup Monster and. Like a grayish blue lipstick from LA Splash. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. I don't know. Anyways. Um, and then I'm trying really hard to think because it's like villainous or like malicious or like some random name like that. Mm-mm. Anyways. Um, and then it takes really long to get us both in frame, so I'm not going to grow hard. Yeah, and that. you'll also, um, I'll, in the picture, but I'll push a yeah, picture yeah. in here somewhere and you'll see her lipstick. It was amazing. It was really cool. Um, and then I got my <clears> Colour <throat> Pop Lipstick and Trap, which is quickly becoming my like go to. It's nude, but it's not. And I love it. I wore this at graduation. Mm-hmm. Um, and then Mistletoe from Jeffree Star. That's an awesome one. This one's really pretty. I went back and forth whether or not I was going to do this or blue today, and then I was like, blue's kind of your thing, so yeah. go with blue. Yeah. That's what I did. Um, I thought I would talk about brushes a little bit, just because that might be interesting to use to see what I travel with. Um, so I have the holiday brush from last year and the holiday brush from this year from Wayne Goss for like, um, I use this one for bronzer mostly, and this one for the ambient lining powder business that happens towards the end. I also brought um, the blending brush, but I didn't use it. And I brought, um, oh wait, that has a number. What is that number? It's 03. And I brought the 02 for a highlighter, which I did use because 
Guys, it's Wayne Goss wishes. I mean, we got some Hakahotas today, but I think Wayne Goss is made by Chicken Hodo. Chick, chicken? Chicken Hodo. Chicken Hodo. <laughs> um, I think uh, it's made by Chicken Hodo, and so they're awesome too. Um, so I brought the 55 brush for blush from Sephora, and then a metric ton of blending brushes from Morphe here. And also liner brushes and pencil brushes from Murphy. I'm not gonna detail these. They're 508s and stuff. You already know all these. And that's my complete. What do you bring? What is that? Is that the teddy bear brush? I think so. Oh my god. Is this the teddy bear brush from Too Faced? That's a good one. So yeah, I use my this for my powder foundation, but it's super super soft and it makes me happy. Wait, did you put a liquid and then a powder? Liquid and then a powder. Well, because I gotta set that liquid. Because I get oily. Doesn't the powder just regular powder set it? Yeah, but I like I've been liking using the powder foundation to set it. It makes the face that much warm. Um, kabuki. Mm -hmm. Do I look kabuki? No. This one's better than the El Masco. The El Masco looks like face, but I kind of like that look. No, yeah, this is way more natural. Well, okay, we're gonna go through some brushes here. Let's talk about it. There aren't that many. Let's detail it, just it looks out. Like there are a lot. Um, I got some Morphe in there. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, so I bought like 14, no, I bought three of my two and sevens. Let me see this. I've never seven. actually seen one. No, I don't have one. What do you use? I only use blending brushes ever. I don't ever. You don't use I don't use labels. No, I, I learned how this. to. I learned how to do my makeup, so I cannot not use that. I hate flat, flat, flat brushes. I don't know why. But yours is puffier than the normal flat ones. Because I used it and washed it and used it and washed it and used it. Actually, I think this would make me happier. Do you want because one? It would, no, because it oh. picks it up, right? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, no, yeah. I don't want one of these, but like, you know what I mean? Okay, but you can have one. Thanks. Okay. I love you that one. Uh, 242, which I would use for like glitter and stuff. Uh -huh. um, so this one is from Burberry, which is technically, I think, a lip brush, but I use it for like my inner corner highlight. Yeah. That's good. That one, so good. This one? Uh huh. The 42. So this one is awesome for like hard pack blushes, but what I love using it and what I use it for today is there's the cream blush in that cheek palette, that sleek mm -hmm. palette, mm -hmm. and it'll just deposit it and blend it so well. So it's this is the instant blend. It's awesome. Uh, do you know what I'm looking No, it's just the NARS blush brush. It's the brush new one that came out with it. It has a number. Dual intensity blush brush. But I can't find it. Uh, I hope, is it? Wait, I see it. It's right there. This is like China on it. Oh, does it? No, it says 23. Did you know that the tw number 23 means China? That's what that means. Here you go. Thank you, man. <laughs> She's had it with me. It was about two days together. <laughs> uh, this very dirty brush is my a Cosmetics Velvet Luxe brush. Oh. For foundation. Doesn't that feel like Dakota? That Dakota's yes. like that. That was what right? it was. Yeah. The other day, I'm like, I was talking to them about it. I'm putting it. I kind of was like, what is this mm -hmm. brush madness? It's so soft. My cat is black, and it, like, she looks like that brush. I'm never going to get over the bonding moment we had on Friday morning, that cat and I. Uh -huh. I'm, br I'm, I'm wearing on her. It's my cats exciting. are awesome. Uh, this is the number 19 taper brush for uh, the Grace. Right Sephora. 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 Yeah. That's a great brush. This one. I love that brush. The blend hand. Although now that I have the Hakahoda brushes, I feel like these ones Shh. may not. You need backups. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, the blend hand from the bomb for my under eye uh -huh. concealer. Oh yeah. It's good stuff. It blends it really well. It does. Uh, this one is, I think, the 41 from NARS. Mm -hmm. That's a good brush too. Under eye setting. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is from Inglot. It's like the some random. That's Inglot. Oh, yeah. I thought that was Murphy. One six B J F. It feels like a Murphy brush. It's soft. I like it. Yeah. It's a little bit spiky, but I like the shape of it. It's flat, so I use yeah. this for my Gehenna setting powder. Can you say that again? Gehenna. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> uh, two oh nine for uh, brows from Mac. Two thirty nine under eye powder from Mac. Not my favorite, but it works fine. Um, I actually don't like Mac brushes. Do you know that? Yes, I do. Just in general, I don't like Mac I brushes. I bought my Mac brushes before Morphe was the thing. No, it's not even Morphe that takes them out. I just don't it like them. Out. I just don't like them. I feel like they're scratchy. What do you use for your eyes? Well, now I use Morphe, but I've used all sorts of other things too. I've used e.l.f. brushes before. Yeah, I wouldn't use Mac. Really? Yeah, I think no. they're too scratchy. E.l.f. Like is them. super scratchy. No. I think you need to wash them right. I wash them like I wash all my other brushes and they all turn out fine. Okay. I, I will take your Mac yeah. Yeah. I don't have any because I don't like them. Where do are they? I've gotten rid of them. I've given them no. Oh, okay. I only have one friend. It's really sad. <laughs> that was my life for years yeah. and years and years. <laughs> so I had dinner today. I'm like, oh, this is what life is supposed to be like. Kick ass. <laughs> but I also like didn't want to say that out loud and like scare everybody away. <laughs> I'm like, shh. shh she got to me 
about some much of you my like friends. The, don't yeah. tell them how much you like them. We'll freak <laughs> them out like you do with everyone else. No, they know Chris. It's okay. You can't freak them out. <laughs> Chris is my husband. He's a total creeper, but he, I love oh, him. Oh, the heart of gold. Heart of gold. He's the nicest and most patient man I've ever met in my life. Why is it close second, though? To what? To nice Chris. And pa- yeah. yeah, nice and patient. No, but Chris, yeah. t- Chris is, like, different level. Yeah, I guess he can put up with me. Anyway. No, but he just... Okay, we're not going to roll. This is not a Chris video. I'll make a Chris video, okay? <laughs> Powder and sculpt from uh-huh. Charlotte Tilbury for Bronx. <laughs> the bon- Yeah. And we're back. <laughs> uh, we talked and giggled for so long that my camera cut off and died. And it actually got so hot that my battery was like, nope, not working anymore. So I had to like take it, switch the battery out so it was cool enough. What were we talking about? The Charlotte Tilbury. It's fresh. Which I use for uh, bronzer and contour. It's the um, powder and sculpt. Oh, yeah. I've wanted to see this brush my whole life. My um, whole entire life. My whole, yeah, since I was like, maybe like two. So not all the, 36 years though. Right? Yeah. Um, this is a beautiful brush. <laughs> it is not a Chikahoto or a Hakahoto no, brush. No, no. I like the shape and I bought one. Please tell me I bought one from Hakahoto. I'm pretty sure. You bought one that was that shape, yeah. Yeah, because I wanted something that was the shape but, you but take soft. It out to and <laughs> so when I filmed that video, I'm like, surprise! <laughs> surprise! <laughs> I don't want to take them out of the things because I want to put them on the plane and not have them bend before I get home. Uh huh. You can I'm put them back weird. in the thing. You can put them in there. You can't get them back in that plastic thing to save your life I once can. you've gotten them out. You just slip it from the bottom up. That's how it works. Maybe. Okay. We'll see about that. Japanese people aren't like miracle workers. Like you can get it in the thing. <laughs> I tried with my nose brushes. Did not work. Okay. We'll talk about this off camera. Okay. Um, Ooh, I do not oh. know what this one is the one with the seam on the outside. That makes you really mad. I don't even want to look at that. <laughs> I don't know what number this is, but they have this in the permanent collection from Mac, and it's really good for blush. I'm putting it away. Okay, let me actually see it, so I can explain why I hate this thing. Okay, it's actually a really nice brush. Uh, it could be softer. Um, but this is the Mac Golpe brush, uh, blush brush. Um, but see this seam here? Do you see this? Like, this just, like, catches, and it, like, oh, it feels weird in your hand. Mm. I like it. I it hasn't caught anything. Do not put it in your mouth. <laughs> I just want a little. Don't you put it in your mouth? Don't, is that a Canadian thing? That's what she said. Okay. <laughs> it's like so kids wouldn't eat poison, but okay, cool. Whoa, no, that's a Canadian thing. It was like on a no, yeah, mm-hmm. okay, Canadian thing. Yeah. It CBC, They're probably Canadian broadcasting. I don't know. We don't CBC. have that. Ooh, what's that? The Sunny Kashuk, uh brow brush. Is it naturally purple or do you have purple brow gel? No, no, no it's naturally purple. Oh, okay, I was getting I, like, really excited brow- about purple no. brow gel. That'd be awesome. Yeah, wouldn't it? Um, I think you can take clear brow gel and, and use shadow in it to make it purple. I think you could probably also use like colored mascara. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Although that stuff doesn't, like I think shadow would actually work better. Probably. Yeah. Okay. That one and then this angled shadow brush from Real Techniques, which Ooh, I actually used today. That was part of some set. I, lo- I wish they sold that individually. Oh my Because it does like the perfect cat eye Is this the one that you're like, that I've always I don't using. even have to like think about this? Yeah. I've never seen this brush before. You should use it tomorrow. Or you're not going to like it tomorrow, but you should use it. Yeah, it's beautiful. It. Oh, it's really soft too. It's, yeah. yeah. Real Techniques is bomb, guys, if you see that stuff. But they're our original line, not the new stuff. Yeah, I don't like the, what are those called? The like metallic ones? Bold metals. The bold metals yeah. ones that, that are really long. So they just are obnoxious in your cup. And also, the like it's like an angled, um, what is that called, ferrule? Like the handle yeah, is the angled, angled. So that it doesn't roll, which is like a genius idea, but it doesn't feel lovely in your hand. Which also, they're sucks. like at least double the price of the originals, and they yeah. don't feel, like they feel cheap. And I like the original handles because they actually had really fat, wide handles, and, and they, they felt really good in yeah. your hand, and they stand up. And, they're, they're changing. Oh, and they had a little wide bottom, too, that would make it stand. They're making them like new and improved for this new year, so the colors are like even more bright and stuff. Like they look really pretty. You oh, but they out. have the old. It's the same style. style, like it looks the same, but mm-hmm. they've like vamped up the colors. And oh, okay, things. that's cool. I like so. packaging on things, so that's awesome. Anyway, um, I think that's about all we got in our makeup vibes, right? Not that's all we got. We just rambled on for twenty five minutes about this stuff. It's probably more than twenty five right now, probably. <laughs> anyway, um, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to me and her if you haven't. I'll leave all that information down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day, guys. Bye. Bye.
That's a good teacher. Yeah, it is a good teacher.